In this lesson, I will solve the problem Weather Observation Station 5 from the subcategory Basic Select in the SQL category Hacker Rank. So let's get started. So we're asked to query the table station and provide two rows. The first row being the city with the shortest name, the second row the city with the longest name, and as the second column, you also want to show the length. So as you can see, if you scroll down, here's an example. If you have four rows with the city names D, E, F, A, B, C, P, Q, R, S, W, X, Y, you have the sample output here. So the first row is for the shortest length. In this case, we have D, E, F, and A, B, C, but which one do we choose? The problem states that we should pick, if they have the same length, we should pick the one that's first alphabetically. So A comes first before the D, so therefore should a choose A, B, C. And because there are three characters in A, B, C, we have to show the as the second column, three here. Now for the next row, that's the longest. Now we have P, Q, R, S as the longest. We have four characters. So we have to say for the first column, the name of the city, P, Q, R, S, then from the second column, the length of PQRS, that's four characters. Okay, so we can do two separate queries to solve this problem, as you can see in the note here. Okay, so let's get started. And if you want to choose, I'm going to choose my SQL, and I'm going to go here and select star from station, just so we can see what the data looks like. And we can see that there is like this. Now, if you want to get the shortest and the longest city names, there's a technique we can use. We can use order by to order all the rows by a certain column, and then we can get just the first column, the first row. And we combine order by with limit one, so we can get only one at the top. And we can do that for the shortest and for the longest. One, we will sort the length ascending and get the first row that's the shortest. The other one, we're going to sort by length descending and we get the first row that's the longest. So let's get started with the first query for the shortest. So we can go here and say order by and then we want to order by the city name like so. And if you say limit one, that will only take the first row. So if I order by city name, it's going to be alphabetically the first and then going down. But that's only the secondary thing we want to order by. We actually want a length, right? So we can call length function here like so. So that means you're going to order these records by the length of the city. And by default, it's ascending, so ASC is implicit here. You don't have to say it. So the very first row, we have the shortest length, while the last row will have the longest length. And when you say limit one, you take the very first one. So as you can see here, we have this city Rai, three characters, and all these extra columns that we don't need. So if you want to narrow down here, you can say city, but we also need to add the number of characters. So I can say comma, length of city as the second column. Let's run the code and see what we get. We should get Rai followed by the second column, three. Okay, we got that, but our answer is wrong because we have to think about what if there's also another city with the same number of characters? How do we pick which one is going to be? Well, 
if we have the same order number of characters here you have to add a secondary order by and that's when you add a comma after the first so if they happen to have the same length we should also sort by this second column here and that's going to be city we want to sort by the name of the city right alphabetically and that's ascending by default when I pick the one with the very first letter in the alphabet and if you compare them the letter has to come before so that's the default ascending okay so we got ammo underscore three there and that's nice. We still got the wrong answer because we need to do longest as well. So we're going to follow the same pattern. So we're going to select. We want the city name followed by the length of the city from the table name station. And we want to order by length of city. But in this case, to get the longest, I'm going to order by the length but descending so that the very first column is the one of the longest. So I'm gonna say D E S C right after length of city. So it can order descending. And you want to limit that to one so we get that very first row. And also add the secondary sorting here. If they happen to have the same length, you're gonna order by city ascending alphabetically, right? Okay, now we got the test passing and let's click submit. And it's a success and that's weather observation station five.